Lamar just got a microphone. Sam Aljami, J-Rock back in the ring. And I apologize for the slight audio issues. It's hard to hear. J-Rock slammed Matt LaBarge, our ring announcer, into the audio and, and visual desk booth, whatever it is we have. And now they're just, these four men are just destroying Sam Aljami. And j Rock saying that he was sent here. Spawn and Nikki Ratu still fighting from earlier tonight. And these sports continue to. Oh, the microphone off the head of Sam Aljami. Deuce has got a deuce. Get these guys out of here. What is. What the world is J Rock talking about? J Rock calling for a pile driver. Now Sam is at a grueling match against J Rock. And oh my gosh! Microphone shot to Deuce Diamond and Hendricks just dumps him out. We need to get some type of control here as these four are just standing over Sam Aljami, but oh, wait a second, here it's Rob Lee, hi guy. I think that's Connor Knox, yeah it is Connor Knox, Kapo Paul, and this ball is underway, these eight, nine individuals, and a recap, J-Rock is saying that he was sent here by somebody, or a conglomerate of somebody, he's referring to himself as we, and you see that gorgeous Gregory, and, and, Connor Knox and High Guy trying to fight him up, but Hendricks getting involved, trying to talk about what I'm seeing here. The cameras are even flickering a little bit. Like I said, ring announcer Matt Labarge was thrown into the audio visual, visual booth there by J-Rock. And this ball is just completely breaking down here within the UCW arena. Who in the world is, is J-Rock talking? Who would J-Rock answer to? J-Rock doesn't answer to anybody as far as I've known him. Deuce Diamond being helped by Orville. And the locker room is pretty much cleared out. Both of these sides are just beating the other crap out of you. There's chairs on the ground. I'm sorry, I'm trying to do my best to talk about what I'm seeing. 
J Rock Daddy now back in the ring with Cowpoke Call, who made his debut earlier tonight. Connor Knox on the outside being handily beaten down by Gorgeous Gregory and Hendricks. A couple of Paul could be looking for that tornado DDT we saw him hit earlier. Turn the tides back one way. No, J Rock able to, oh, a thumb to the eye. And of course, there's no rule here. I mean, there's nothing here. Power driver center of the ring. And whoever they are, J Rock Daddy, Gorgeous Gregory Hendricks, and Junior Underwood currently have. Taking control, but wait a second, that's Sam Aljami! The Desert Dragon, the television champion, Nick Missile Dropkick! Is Sam Aljami standing tall in the ring, joined now again by Rod Lee. And High Guy as J-Rock Daddy regroups with the rest of his teammates, I guess. I'm trying to hear what Sam Aljami is saying. Show's over. This is. The same as Zami trying to get these guys back to the ring to finish his life. Like, 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 everyone watching at home. The show's over. And we had our main event. Samuel Jami and Crew Rod Lee. This is not a joke. This is not a game. You want to play rough, well, you want to play dirty. I promise you, we will make this ring, this company, and your asses suck your feet. The Samuel Jami and Rod Lee standing tall alongside High Guy. How about Paul and Connor Knox right Where now? Where are you from? Right here in Saginaw, Michigan. Yeah. Here! And you see the new little ladies there. Is this on the Dungeon Dragon? J-Rock found a microphone. You see, as much as, much as me and these bad mama gemmas right here would love to finish kicking your ass right now, we got bigger, hey, hey, we answer the way bigger people than Rod Lee and Sam Aljani here. We answer the way bigger people than ECW, and in just a couple of weeks, you're gonna find out that there's way more to me than you have the slightest idea, son. Because we are everywhere. We are already here, and we are gonna burn this place to the ground. Who, who could J Rock be talking about? He said a couple of weeks will know that. In a couple weeks, that, that's September 14th. Saturday, we'll be back here in the UCW arena. You got to imagine that's what J Rock's referring to a couple weeks. Hopefully, we'll have some more answers by then. But. They don't know what they got themselves into. I'm going to tell these motherfuckers what it means to me. Well, despite the onslaught from J Rock Daddy and Company, Sam Al Shami and Co. here in the UCW, we are standing tall, and uh, we'll tell you more as we know it.